हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल माय सेल पर एग्जाम्पल को इन सेलिनियम टू एंटर टेक्स इनटू दिस टेक्स बॉक्स वी कॉल सेंट किज मेथड इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी हाउ टू एंटर टेक्स इनटू द टेक्स बॉक्स विदाउट कॉलिंग सेंट किज मेथड फॉर दिस पर्पस वी विल यूज जावा स्क्रिप्ट एग्जीक्यूटर इंटरफेस इन मेनी सेलिनियम इंटरव्यू दिस क्वेश्चन इज फ्रिक्वेंटली आज नाउ सी हाउ टू डू दिस फर्स्ट विल इंस्पेक्ट now see this is the html code for this text box right so it has id login1 and name login right now see we'll go to console and here we'll type the command okay now see document dot get element by now see these are the various options right so by id by name by tag name by class name by tag name ns so see uh, by id it is get element but by name it is get elements right so keep in mind because we have to use it in next uh, example so see get elements okay and by id it is get element right so get element by id that will you now see in round bracket we have to mention its id so id was login 1 right okay round bracket complete dot value Is equal to suppose uh, I want to give A B C D E something like this. Okay, now see I press enter. So here you can see A B C D E is printed in this text box, right? Now see. So here we have used get element by ID. Now uh, we will use get element by name. So that will do. So document document dot get element now see get elements so see get elements by name it will be there get elements by name now see so what is name login so that we have seen login right now see this is get elements it is a plural right get elements by name and because of this we have to give provide this index okay now see dot value is equal to in double quote suppose i am giving 1 2 3 4 5 something like this okay press enter so here you can see 1 2 3 4 5 right so these are the javascript commands and we are running it from the console right now see same uh, command will run in our selenium code so see i am copying this here we will write code now see so we'll create we'll use javascript executor interface javascript executor now see i'm creating an object js is equal to see this driver we have to allocate to this javascript executor object now see we have to type cast it javascript executor Okay, so that we have done. Now so it is showing red line, so we'll import package for this. Okay, it is done. Now see, by using this JS object, we have to call execute script. This method we have to call. Now see, there are two parameter, but we require only one. So in double quote, here we have to paste it. So whatever the command that we have run on this console, same command will paste here. Okay, now see. Okay, we'll run our code. Let us see. So here you can see A B C D E. That text got printed or entered into this text box. But here we have not called send keys method, right? Here we have not called send keys method. Without calling send keys method, we are entering this text, right? We'll see next command. See. Uh, one more command we have tried it so here we have mentioned get element by id now here we have used get elements by name okay so that i am copying and uh, that will try okay js dot execute script so one parameter in double quote will paste it okay semicolon will run our code So 
So see here you can see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Right? So in this way, we can enter text into text box without calling send keys method. Now see here uh, we have used get element by ID and get elements by name. So see, but uh, see here we are using ID of that web element and name of web element, right? But suppose that tag doesn't have ID or name. So in that situation, how to manage this? So see, for that purpose, we have to take help of CSS selector code. Now see, see I am removing this. What we'll do? Again, inspect see, selector sub. Uh, directly I am taking uh, CSS selector from the selector sub plugin. So see in selector sub, uh, we will copy this relative to CSS selector. See not X path. Copy relative CSS selector code. Okay. We have to create CSS selector code. Okay. See one element matching and it is also getting selected. Right. So I am copying this. Now see on console what we have to do. Document dot query selector query selector okay so see uh, here in selenium we call css selector right for that in javascript we have function query selector now see here in round bracket we will paste this css selector code okay remaining thing is same so dot value is equal to in double code uh, suppose we will enter a b c d 1 2 3 4 something like this okay now see press enter so see when we press enter so this a b c d 1 2 3 4 got entered into the text box right so same code if we run from the selenium so this code will get entered in the text box see js dot execute script here one parameter will provide okay so here we are providing a b c d one two three four right we'll run our code so see a b c d one two three four that text got entered into the text box so in this way we can enter text into the text box without calling synchronous method by using we can do this by using javascript executor interface i will provide this code in my blog post and that blog post link i will provide in description box from there you can take this code so friends i hope you like this video if it is then click on like subscribe to the channel and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you will get notification of my next video so stay connected thank you